what is going on guys it's your boy xymb back with the grand theft auto 5 video now in this video it will be how to get white joggers and now this is for the female char character um and yeah so before this video starts before i show you what to do hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you do get notifications when i upload what you need to do first is you need to make a male character and the male character needs to be on the second slot um so you'll have a female in the uh, first slot and then a male in the second so once you've done that you'll spawn in you probably have some annoying loading screen about diamond casino um but once you've had that you just want to make your way to any type of clothing store so obviously i'm at this one it doesn't matter which one you can go that one that one that one and yeah so once you have come there you just want to go outside of it and walk straight into it and once you've walked in you want to take all your accessories off all your gloves everything and once you've done that so i'm just gonna give you a second all right so obviously if you do need to pause it to take it all off you can okay so um so the first thing you need to do is go to the tops section go to uh where is it to suit jackets and buy number 33 which is quite close to the top so just go if you go from the top and it is called the gray rolled jacket so there it is right there it'll look like that and yeah so once you've got that you just want to back out and walk all the way over to the trousers so use the trousers right here and sorry and you want to go down and try and find the shorts so there they are and you just want to scroll down until you get to number 10 which should be the tan striped boxer shorts so the black leopard ones are for black joggers the tan ones are for white joggers so once you've added the white joggers on well the tan striped boxer shorts on number 10 you want to back out and go to the shoes okay so once you've got to the shoes you want to scroll down until you see smart shoes and you want to try and get the gay gray slip ons on number 60 so just go from the top and go down to the bottom it should be called gray slip ons on number 60. so once you've done that you then want to walk all the way over to the hat section so that is over here right there and once you're in the hat section you want to then go to caps forward and it should be at the very bottom called Fangrelot Green Cap. So obviously this is the one right here. Go straight from the top, down and there. So once you've done that, you want to then back out again and go over to the glass section. So just walking over there now. So the glasses, you want to write, you want to press right on the D-pad and go to Aviator Glasses. You then want to try and find the silver eyewear on number 15 so just go straight down to the bottom and just scroll down until you do see the silver eyewear once you've got that then back out once again and go over to the accessories once you're on the accessories go to ties and find the white skinny tie so it should just be at the very bottom on 64 and you just want to get that then you want to back out and go into gloves you then want to get the black fingerless gloves on number 56 at the very bottom once again now once you've done that back out again and you then want to go and go to the uh watches and you want to try and find the lime eye fruit tech be careful you don't get the prb eye fruit tech just make sure it is a lime green which is on number 31 so you should if you have been watching the video you should be on where i am right now which is good we have got the outfit now this is the main thing don't forget to go over here and save the outfit so save it over whatever outfit you want and i recommend not calling it white so call it like w1 but white one so like that uh make sure you have no other outfits so just delete them all on your second character so there we go we have none once you've done that you then want to go into the inter interaction menu and press kill yourself 
there we go so this is now forcing a save um if you don't know this obviously forces a save so when you are doing a glitch it doesn't mess anything up and once you've spawned in just wait and then once you have waited so just walk around a little bit go to online go to then creator press a twice and then when you will load it into the sky okay so once you have loaded in you then want to go to create a race scroll down until you see land race so it's a third one and it will then take you back out to the clouds and it will be in this race details then go to race details title write anything so i'm just going to write this and you may as well do it because it is free so you know um then put anything as the description it doesn't really matter and just choose any photo so just press any photo like that now this is the main thing go to maximum players is two and race type as standard and route type as point to point once you've done that now you should be where i am you then want to go to your map and press a right to where i press a so at the very bottom on the airfield um and yeah so you should be here then you want to go to placement press place trigger go to lobby camera press a go to checkpoints and you now want to build it closest to there so there we go and you then want to make your way over there now this is a trick nobody knows about well most people don't know about if you hold y it does make you go quicker so that is really good okay so you want to make it about 0.64 miles which i think is about 0.84 kilometers and once you've done that press out the checkpoints go to race details again and try and find where it says the available cars and make sure it's only on supers so it does make it quicker there we go so now we are only on supers you can then change this until to a fast car so i'm just going to choose the kruger and then you just want to test the race Okay, so once you have finished the race, you should want to press A. You should be in this screen. Go to online. Go to then. Once you are online, go to choose character. Press A again. So press A again. We'll wait for this loading screen right now. Come on. There we go. So now you should be in this uh this police station, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it is a police station. God knows. Oh, nice little cup of coffee there. Might have one in a bit. But anyway, stop getting off topic. <laughs> so obviously, you want to go to your second character right here. You want to go to delete. Press A and write in delete. So let's just write that in right here. Delete. Now, what is this doing? This is transferring the right character to the left character. Everything stays so you don't have to worry about that. But everything on your main character you will lose so once you've done this you want to press b to exit to gta 5 so this will take you to story mode do not press a on the main character do not press a and go straight into online because that will mess up the glitch so please make sure you just do press a at oh press b then a so you do exit into story mode you will see at the bottom i think it's the bottom right you will see it but yeah, so now we're just going to wait for this loan screen right here. Shouldn't take too long because you are going to story mode from uh, choose character. So it is quite quick. But once you are in, you want to go to online. Play online and then invite only. We're going into invite only. It doesn't matter if you go to um, just a, a normal online session. But just when you are doing it, go into invite only just so you don't get killed or anything like that. Nobody annoys you. And it actually, as a matter of fact, does make it go quicker. So we are just going to wait for this loading screen right now. Okay, so you should have just spawned in.
and if you go to style it should say the outfit that you have so obviously i call mine w1 but you know you could have called it something different so um obviously just make sure when you do have the outfit then let's try and find my okay so uh everything might glitch out a little bit because you have kind of you know basically glitched your game but um okay so it should say w1 if it doesn't um, you might have done something wrong if sometimes whilst you are doing the glitch it can actually mess up um, and it doesn't show you I don't know where my oppressor is I think it's just gone to be fair but you know don't worry about that you then just want to get any vehicle uh, so I'm just going to get my car right now and you want to make your way to any type of clothes store so I will just fast forward it right now Okay, so once you have made it to the clothing store, you just want to walk straight in. And now this is the thing. So you want to start with the outfit that you want to save. So obviously this is the outfit I want to keep. So you want to go down to the bottom and just call it anything. So there we go. And now this outfit is now saved. Now what you actually can do is you can see in here I have sub and then W1. If I press A on it, it then does come with the white joggers right there so obviously it has got accessories on it which you don't worry about i'm pretty sure you can take them off we'll just check now yeah so obviously you can take them off like so i need to change these shoes as well if you want to but that is how you do get white joggers after patch 1.51 and yeah so i hope you enjoyed don't forget to like subscribe and comment for more videos like this and i will see you in the next one See ya!